What is up, Koi family? Welcome back to the Jabby Koi channel. I'm Achara Kirk, joined by Steph Sabra. What up, bro? What up? <laughs> we're carrying on with Indian matchmaking, partially because you guys were like, we want you to, and partially because we enjoy the crap out of it. We really love it. <laughs> Truly, I'm invested in all of these people, mainly Nadia, as yeah. we just spoke. Yes, Nadia, and then for me, I'm like, I just need to know what's going on with Aparna. Yeah. She just cracks me up. There's never a dull moment with Aparna, and I appreciate her for that. <laughs> <laughs> all right, you guys, if you want to watch the entire episodes along with us, you can do that by uh, joining us on Patreon. Patreon, patreon.com slash or by becoming a member right here on the channel. You will need your own Netflix subscription though in order to watch the show along with us, but we make it really easy for you to sync up. So don't even worry about it. If you are watching this on YouTube, which you are, uh, please don't forget to subscribe. Click that bell icon, all notifications on so you know whenever we drop a new video and upvote this video if you are enjoying what you're watching. All right, without further ado, let's get into this. I'm Suresh Kabra. She's Sunita. I was thinking the same thing. Oh my gosh. <laughs> She's spicy. I like it. Parents ne bola bas shaadi karni hai. Bombay le aaye. Inko dikhaya maine inko nahi dekha. Why? Agar dekhti to reject kar dete. Oh harsh. Harsh. Wow. Pata nahi blackmail tha hai. Wohi destiny thi hamari. Ye aaj bhi sambhalti hai. Ye bhi mujhe sambhalte hai. Oh. Oh. What? Every I couple actually, so different. That was yeah, like cute. I appreciate these things yeah. at the beginning because like you, you get a glimpse at like the There's, different types of relationships yeah. that can happen. I've had a uh, difficult time. I've had a, quite a few rejections as well. I'm not just a rich pretty boy. <laughs> oh, like people rejected uh, him? Rishali. Lovely meeting you. Thank you. Thank you guys. Okay, she you. is beautiful. Yeah. How was your flight? Good. Oh, she's got like the fashionable yeah. half tuck in. Your anxious and nervous always. First time you're meeting a person. First you need to calm down, relax. It's just a meeting. That's why you have some alcohol. Yeah. <laughs> so, what's happening? You tell me. What do you do? Oh my gosh, she's so nervous. So acting and I'm modeling. It's been. Uh, Nine years now. Oh, I have modeled once, I, and I think it's difficult. It to... is. It has to come natural, right? Yeah. Huh? Instead of being on phone, I would prefer a book. Wow, okay. that's crazy. That's, how that's a good is. habit, huh? Yeah. Well, conversations were nice, uh, definitely, and it got us going. There is definitely a likability, which is there. Okay. Good. Okay. All right. You should have gone for a horse ride yeah. saying, oh no, goat yoga. Yes. <laughs> oh my gosh, with the parna, she's gonna flip. No, she's gonna freak out. This is like when a little baby goat comes and poops on your mat. Doesn't she not like activities like this? Bow over your ankles. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. The goat likes a parna. Oh, good vibes. I think it really helps break the ice. I need to do this. <laughs> it's they all fun and games until it so. poops on your mat. Yeah. Do I got zeros? <laughs> Not looking good for me. <laughs> oh my gosh, little they are nugget. Adorable, oh, wow. Reach out, hold hands, and share the love. Maybe share the balance. I need your balance. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's cute. I would love to see him again. Oh, that's actually a really fun first date that's idea. That's so fun. I, I'm a big believer in activities for a first date because if it breaks the ice and if it's not going well, then you can just do the activity. Yeah, and activities that like, give you conversation. Like yes. you can always talk about what the goats are doing. Exactly. <laughs> I was pretty nervous. What is going to be like? He come across to be a very good person. Oh, okay. He's a sweetheart. He's a sweet guy. Sweet, okay. humble guy. Positive. Positive. Just, I don't know. With him, I'm like, I'm not holding my breath. I know, because he seems very guarded. Yeah. I never thought of it. I mean, to meet somebody. I just, I'm not. Yeah. <laughs> That's fun. All right, guys, let him go. Let him yeah. go. Be free. See my aunties, talk to me. You can definitely meet some interesting people if you are open. Oh. I had a very big apprehension. It was arranged marriage, but I think it'll be pretty cool to get married. You can buzz me if you want. 
Aww. Aww, that was positive. After passing so many hurdles, like, then finally, I'm glad Pradyu one had such a good first meeting. I predict that things will move fast and smoothly. Okay. The rest is up to destiny. Oh my God, so much laughter. Yeah. They're hitting it off. I was not sure that that was going to happen. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, he's too picky. Yeah, but growth too. Yeah. 23 when I got married. Whoa. And now you're 25. Clock is ticking. Oh. Yeah, but why should you say? <laughs> I'll be stuck for life. Eh? And I said, what a wrong decision. He's like, TikTok, I need you to be as miserable as me. You know how mom is. Oh, no. Y'all better chill. <laughs> 25. He you doesn't have <laughs> eggs. Like, he's yeah. fine. Along with this, we give some heritage jewelry for the daughter-in-law. Wow. What? What? Those are all real, aren't they? Now we just need to find a girl. Uh, Who will put up with him. Because that is Damn, very, very important. Damn, they've got money. They are rich. I have been working very hard to find a suitable girl for Akshay. He hasn't told me what he wants. Hmm. What's your uh, preferences? Just tell me, that's the same. Mom or dad decide. Tera bhi to kuch bol. Yes. Mom bhi chhodega to kaise hoga? Oh, tumhe milne ke baad bataunga na. Ha. Yeah, but what? Help Seema auntie out. I'm really close to my mom. Aww. Uh, I can say extremely close. Okay, that's the problem. Yeah. Above five three, fir iski height ko match hota hai. Okay. Okay, what about what's on the inside? <laughs> yeah. Mujhe lagta hai thoda. Aww. She's she's building an army. Yeah. Ladki sanskari. Team pretty. Say beautiful ya sirf ye aise nahi chahiye. I'm not looking for just beautiful. Nobody gets a perfect dream life partner. My mom is literally what I want to be looking at uh, in a wife. Yeah. Okay. I mean there is a theory that most guys end up marrying yeah. their mother. But I think it's a little bit late. So, my attention is coming. It's a bad thing. It's positive. I don't know why Akshay's mother is so eager. This is the first time I've ever seen this. Pretty is like, no. No. And this is the first time I've seen this. कि at least उसका हाँ मतलब मेरा बस चले तो मैंने दिसंबर नवंबर दिसंबर नहीं कर दूँ मुझे लगता है अभी आपको भी स्पीड थोड़ा सा बढ़ा देना पड़ेगा ओह ओह शी टोल्ड हर शी टोल्ड हर आई कैन बिलीव शी एवरीथिंग वी हैव टू एग्री व्हाट एवर द क्लाइंट्स इस वाओ आई मीन दैट्स योर लाइफ पार्टनर दैट्स योर I don't know how to create romance, and I have to okay. remind myself, look, that's okay too. That is okay. You can learn. You fall in love, you fall in love. Yeah. He's such an optimist. I like his personality a lot. The first meeting which I set up with Piyasa and Manisha went very well. Mm. He lives in Texas and she lives in North Carolina. But it's not a problem. A lot of Indian marriages happen where couple lives far away. So what'd you do today? Oh, I cleaned my, I cleaned my bathroom. I realized I hadn't cleaned my bathroom in a while and was <laughs> it's not that I forget how hairy I am, but I forget that like what it looks like when it accumulates. I was like, oh yeah, clean. <laughs> I understand the struggle. It like has a tank of water. Yeah. Yeah. yeah that's so awesome. I love it. it really? So <laughs> yes, vacuum. <laughs> this is how you know you're in your thirties. You talk about home appliances, <laughs> and it's the best conversation ever. I just had a moment. It's fine. <laughs> Oh my gosh, so cute. एक तो देखिए मनीषा दास का जन सकता है क्या? मनीषा दास के साथ अगर हम कुंडली मिलान करते हैं तो कुंडली मैच नहीं कर रही है। Oh no. Next आपको मैंने एक अपरना सेवक क्रमानी दी थी। कुंडली में अपरना की जो पर्सनालिटी है। Oh I can't wait. Immediate change कर लेती है। We're all in। Aparna? Yeah। नीचे गई। She will change change her decision। Oh okay। She is very rude in speech। Wow! It's like he knows her। जरा भी नहीं घबराएगी किसी को कुछ बोलने में। 
stop it. I want my astrology read. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's right. She knows that too, though. Yeah. Hi, Aparna. How are you? I'm doing well. It's very busy over here. How is it going in Bombay? Uh, bus, we are busy. Now the marriage season has started. I'm finding a lot of change in you, Aparna. You seem wow. very positive, very positive. <laughs> oh, yeah. There's no cake needed. I don't need flowers. I prefer not to see a first dance. I don't need any of that stuff. You say like, that now. <laughs> no, I mean it. <laughs> <laughs> One thing that I would like is just to have the people oh, that doing your own you know, I care about, which is sure. a lot of people. Here's a little bit more controversial thing. Mm. What if you had no kids? At the wedding. Oh, 100%. There's never going to be a child in my <laughs> <laughs> I mean, although kids don't cost anything, I just don't want them there because they're noisy. and The vibe. The vibe. <laughs> I hear her. Jay definitely was one of the easiest people to get along with and learn about. I think that we had um, a lot to talk about. He was very present with me, which I really appreciated. And I think that says a lot about who he is. Yeah, because she needs someone who's like going to make her the center of yeah. the universe. Way to venture out to see him or have him coming. <gasps> I'd be open to it. I'd be open to it. There okay. we go. You like to travel, Aparna. I loved his energy. Yeah. yeah. Like, a great guy. And I liked the way he talked to you and respected you and your oh, ideas. Oh, he turned up. Sorry, I never got Oh, continue. I, I completely agree with I'm you. Into <laughs> I'd love to see her in Atlanta and to actually see if that's something that she would enjoy and meeting my family and things like that. So yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't want to see a child in my way. <laughs> I don't hate him. So go Jay. <laughs> you won the first girl. <laughs> or, the first I don't the hate him. I don't hate him. That's her criteria. Girl, I've never met anyone like you. <laughs> Aparna has changed a lot. Yeah, she she's has. Good for her. Yeah. She's still stubborn, but <laughs> she's open to her destiny, and I'm proud of her. Mississippi might be a contender. I have a chat. <laughs> we can discuss. <laughs> I feel like she should go to Atlanta now. Yeah. Like, if he came, then she should go. Being okay with, you know, homeschooling my kids, for example. Of course I'm going to talk about education in relation to my own children. This is something that I don't really like about you, and mm. I don't think that I should have to like about you. What? Well, these are the conversations we had. Like, there wouldn't be a second date. Okay, well. Okay. Yeah, this is not, like. By the fourth uh... or fifth phone call, the doubts were rock solid. Yeah. Yeah. Uh... It's a lot to learn in a very short amount of time. We are very different. I don't have a five-year plan. Like, there are some things that I can definitely say that we have in common, but as of right now, yeah, sir. It's okay, dude. Well, good luck. Thank you. Everything. Yeah. And I hope you find a really great life partner. Thanks, bud. Me, you too. Bud. <laughs> well, you know what? I feel like that's a positive yeah. because I feel like sometimes those conversations happen way too late. Way, yeah. yeah. 18 to 20 proposals I got. Us me se wo 10 bara aise uda chuka hai. Aise hi nahi. Dekha main. Okay, you have your own reasons. Ha. Oh, she's pissed. See, you get married this year. And they have a baby next year. You are the culprit. Main roka nahi kisi ko. Nahi, what do you mean by roka nahi? Oh my god. तो उनको तुम्हारा वेडिंग एंजॉय करने के बाद फिर उनको ये करना है आगे बढ़ना है यू एंड पापा डिसाइड देन मी एंड पापा विल फाइनलाइज फाइनल डिसीजन इज माइन नो गुड थैंक यू एवरी फैमिली इज डिफरेंट बट द बेबी टाइम लाइन द वेडिंग टाइम लाइन आई गेट फाइनल से टिक टॉक टिक टॉक the heart of Vyasu is such a nice I love person. a hearty laugh. Such a yeah. loving, such a caring. I think he'll care more for Rashi. From Pasadena. What you thinking of this uh, particular guy? The bio data seem pretty interesting. Yeah. If he can keep up with the fact that I don't know how to put on makeup, maybe that'll... Oh, she's adorable. <laughs> you do not want someone who wants a high-maintenance girl. Oh, yeah. That's not going to happen. I work with animals. I come home with uh, Covered animal poop in, in my various... scrubs. Covered in animal fluids. Yeah. You can play guess what animal fluid this is with That's him. disgusting. <laughs> oh, Ash, I love the brother. I'm expecting a second date. Obviously nervous. It's something that 
27 years old and I haven't had a serious relationship. I've dated, but I haven't had a serious relationship. Um, Aww, but, poor baby. Um, <laughs> oh, I think they're going to be a good match. Maybe. I'm definitely hopeful that I find the right person in this process, that Seema is going to eventually pull out, you know, the ace in the hole, and it's going to be the right person. Oh, I think that's them. All right. Hello. Hello. Oh, dang it. Why you do this episode? It's Come too on. good. It's too good to end on a cliffhanger yeah. like that. Jesus. Wow. I feel like a lot happened in that episode. Yeah. A lot, a lot. That was a packed episode, although we got no Nadia. That's right. But we got a lot uh, on the other. I feel like, uh, what's his name? Vis uh, no. Or Prodium? Yeah, Prod Produmon? Is Produmon? that his name? Update. With I feel like there's been a lot of growth between him and Aparna. Yeah. Which is really cool to see. And they're like, they're like expressing themselves differently and they kind of know what they want a little bit more. Yeah. Which is exciting. Yeah, I mean, they're more open, I think, is the whole thing. If you've reached a point where you're like, I need a matchmaker, because clearly hitting up the bars and the apps like isn't working out for me, or just like being a person in everyday life, it's it's not happening, so I need a matchmaker. I think if you're reaching out to a matchmaker, then you're at a point where you need to be more flexible. Yeah, yes, because like, it's like, this is what you want, like this is what you've decided or your family has decided, yeah. but then you need to also like, if you're okay with your family making decisions for you, you need to be on board with that decision too. Like mentally, yeah. physically, emotionally, whatever it takes. And it, it is true. It's like, like that's a serious step to be with a matchmaker. So you have to approach these people like every date with seriousness. Exactly. And then we were introduced to a new person this episode, yeah. Akshay. Super interesting. So fascinating. I mean, that is a matriarch family. Yeah. For sure. I'm actually kind of scared for the future in-law. Because, like, I looked at his mom and initially I was like, she seems nice outwardly. But I imagine that it would take a little while if you just suddenly came into their household. And she'd probably, like, not have any qualms with, with telling, you're not doing this right. Yeah. This isn't good enough. This isn't up to standard. And, and there would be a big learning curve. And I wonder if that's kind of like a, a common experience with a lot of a lot moms, of women yeah. and who like join a family and then you know because the mom has a way of cooking and cleaning or whatever her yeah. role is yeah it's true like i feel like he wants someone like his mom but if you want someone like your mom then they're gonna butt heads with your mom because there's only one of your mom she That's runs true. the house so yeah. if you want someone who has that like boss vibe there's gonna be problems yeah i hadn't even thought about that it's funny that he's just comfortable to say that because i feel like i don't know if it's something that guy guys are more comfortable with saying like, oh, I want someone just like my mom. But I guess when I think about it, I'm like, if I could find someone who was like my dad, I would be lucky. I know. You know, yeah, my dad's like the best husband to my mom ever yeah. and the best dad for me ever. So it'd be stupid if I wasn't like, there's probably qualities in him yeah. I would like to have in my future man. Yeah. But it is when, you, but my dad would never be like, I'm picking your man. <laughs> like, what? You got to be in the bedroom with this guy every night? Oh, no. <laughs> no, yeah. So, well, I mean, I guess we'll see how, how that turns out there. Yeah. But I really do feel like Vyasa did dodge a bullet there because the types of conversations that he was saying he was having where like you know you just start talking and then suddenly something happens and you know the conversation turns suddenly you're having an argument it turns into a three-hour argument like been in those situations and it's not good and like with the knowledge that i have now looking in hindsight i'm like yeah probably the best thing to do in that situation would have been like you know what this is not working out let's just be friends and we'll call it quits or whatever so in a way i feel like that was a, a positive outcome even though you know <laughs> he's not closer to being married at least to her at least he's not in a relationship that is potentially going to be 
so insufferable. Yes, because really, the beginning of every relationship, I believe, should be easy. Yeah. Life is so hard. There's so many things we can't control. But the person that you're going to spend the rest of your life with, it should be easy until there's outside forces introduced. Right, yeah. And obviously, this is a little different because you are having those serious conversations way earlier. Yeah. And in every single part of the conversation. But still, I think there has to be like, maybe you bump heads on one thing. But like three hours of a spiraling conversation to someone you just met, that sounds miserable. I'm so glad that they both were mature enough to like walk their separate ways. Yeah. And maybe it's easier too, because it's like long distance, you know? Yeah. Because then you're just like, okay, well, I guess it's not working out. So I guess we don't have to call each other anymore. So so. bye, bud. Bye, bud. (laughs) Yeah, that was- Gave her the bud. The the bud, immediate friend zone. Yeah, yeah. All right, dude, I'll see you later. (laughs) Bye. Bye. <laughs> and on that note, bye, bye. you guys. <laughs> this was fun. Um, please subscribe, click that bell icon for all notifications and upvote this video. If you're enjoying what you're watching, we will catch you for the next episode. I'm Achara Cook. This is Steph Sabra. Ciao.